as the provincial government, we really do appreciate this wonderful opportunity that has been given to us. I'm standing here on behalf of MBC PLA who will not be with us today. As you are well aware, we have been affected by the inclement weather which has resulted um, in the loss of lives and infrastructure and as a province we are hard at work to ensure that the restoration of, of some of the infrastructure and ensure that uh, the lives continues. But we do appreciate the presence of the Honourable Minister um, to be here with us um, to also prioritise this issue um, and we are here as a province to ensure that we work together with uh, all the stakeholders uh, this Mangalis as well as led by the national government um, and our view is that the report that will be presented today we do hope that it will uh, close the matter and also define the way forward working with the people. This is the government that is listening to what people want and I do hope that collectively uh, we'll be able to find a solution. We believe in the collective wisdom of the people um, of the province and uh, we appreciate the leadership that is here. So we just want to welcome all of you um, who are here. Uh, just enjoy this day and enjoy the discussion. We hope the discussions will be fruitful and be honest so that we are able to drive the development agenda of government working together. We thank you very much for the opportunity that we've been given. We are here to participate and ensure that whatever we have experienced, we overcome together. Thank you very much. Uh, the report did point to a weakness in the definition of what could have been defined as exceptional circumstances and in its recommendations they emphasized the fact that exceptional circumstances needed to be clearly defined and would need to be backed up with systematic scientific monitoring before any future interventions were undertaken. The report also noted that the existing estuarine management plan does not talk about socio-economic circumstances which might contribute to the exceptional circumstances that would lead to a, a breaching of the mouth. We did submit our concluding remarks to the minister and we said indeed the breach was in line with the management plans. But the suggestion was that these plans account for the EWE advisory report such as the GEF report and the social needs of the society. And it, can, it can't be managed as an isolated system anymore uh, for it to be integrated, as much integrated as possible. And indeed, it is dynamic and can function in a wide range of ecological states. Structured and transparent communication is key for the management of this system in the future. I have just captured those important things to affirm what the minister has alluded to, that indeed the five of us gave this information to the minister after doing the length and the breadth of the wonder is the Mangaliso Work and Park. And now, let me humbly take the opportunity to present the report to the minister and also indicate the excitement that we really had as a panel when we involved in doing this work. Thank you. This then marks the end of our implementation plan in response to all the recommendations. As you probably may have seen throughout my presentation, we have the recommendations of the panel and next to that we have the implementation plan to say what are we going to do as an entity to respond to that. Uh, but again, our, our Honourable Minister is a minister who says we don't want to have a talk show. That is why if you look at the far end of our implementation plan, we have those timelines 
and in certain cases where uh, we needed to reflect on the budget implications, we have done so to indicate that we've applied our minds, we have an idea. But as I said, we have a number of stakeholders that we're working with. We are still going to engage them on this implementation plan and get it properly finalized. But this is the plan to respond to that so that we are not here to listen and uh, go away. So that is what we are committing to do as an entity in response to the recommendations. Thank you very much.